I think for me, I'm, I'm really a true product of the clay community in Goshen. I'm a full-time studio artist. I work in clay primarily. My wife is a, is a painter, so we're both full-time in the studio. We've been working here in Goshen out of our house and home studios since 2009. My first clay experience happened in middle school and really started thinking about working in clay as a, as a job or as potential for that with my high school art teacher. She really was encouraging and after that my experience or my interest in, in exploring clay beyond high school was really sort of solidified. My time at Goshen College as an art major, my professor was Marvin um, Bartell, but, but the other students were also teaching, so there were these 20 and 22 and 24 year olds who were doing really cool things in clay. So we were learning from Marvin, but also there was all of this other information going on at the time. Marvin's, a, I mean, he's a creative force. You know, when you go into your first clay class, you have these ideas about making cups or bowls or plates like any you know, potter would make, but you get to Marvin's house and his toilet is made out of clay and his sink is made out of clay and the floor is made out of clay. And so all of a sudden you realize that like, being a studio artist and working in clay doesn't have to mean just making tableware. I think that that legacy that, that he started is, is continues to perpetuate. There are now students of his students who are teaching. So there's you know, three or four generations of, of his ideas about teaching that are active and working. We had our pottery tour and Marvin is the next stop from my house. The Michiana Pottery Tour is the final weekend of September every year, and uh, myself, Mark Gertzen, and Dick Lehman uh, wanted to have a, a way to collaborate with, with a fall sale each year, and so uh, the idea was to, to create sort of a driving tour through the, through the farmland for people to, to visit working studios, meet clay artists, and see what's going on, and, and see where, where the pots are made the goal for, for us as artists and coordinators, uh, we want to show off the area. There's just lots of good stuff for people to see and so we want people to come and, and see our studios and also realize that this is a good place um, to work as an artist. I think Goshen is a, is a special place for clay because the people who have worked over the years have laid a foundation for, for good clay work that it fits within sort of the, the community aspects of Goshen. The quality of life here is, is great. Um, the cost of living is low, um, but there's lots of great stuff happening, good schools for my kids to go to. Um, and there's a really active community, in particular in Clay, um, a community that's interested in collaborating with each other, and that feels really important.